Yet in spite of all of this progressive behavior, white people still carry the same core belief their racist ancestors did, which was white people are number one. <laughs> They ask you to change your attitude and your lifestyle to be welcomed into the class. But rather than looking for name changes and suppression of a cultural identity, they operate with the belief that all those trying to get into their class are striving to become just like them, to share their complex understanding of wine, to share their understanding of the importance of running a marathon, and of course, for those of you that aren't white, get ready, buy some new shoes. Of course, their progressive politics. I mean, can you imagine anything that would depress a white person more than learning that their refugee friend has given birth to a conservative child? <laughs> it's like finding out your favorite dish isn't vegan. <laughs> to white people, progress is ultimately seen as when everybody else will be exactly like them. Wouldn't China be a better place if everyone acted more like we do in Newtown? <laughs> When you look at this list and you recognize it as white, you see these things as white, what you're actually recognizing is the liberal upper middle class and whiteness are still completely linked, no matter how many ethnic restaurants you eat at. It's a commentary on the fact that even the most progressive people on earth, you still cannot break this link. And when you create a list like I've done, I don't even have to explain it. People automatically understand that it's white. The fact that liberal arts degrees are seen as white is a simple statement about which people in our culture and society have the time and lack of worry about financial problems to pursue these degrees. <laughs> Simply put, if you're looking for an English degree, getting a job is clearly not that important to you. <laughs> for the record, I have an English degree and half of a PhD in, uh, in English as well. It's I know. Actually, when you apply for a PhD program, they give you this coat. <laughs> <laughs> so, as I put this idea out there, it, it's subtle but it's still there, and I get a lot, a lot of angry people writing into this site with suggestions saying, well, shouldn't you start to call stuff liberals like? Or,